Urban Outfitters Kappa going on here. Woo, 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 woo. Ugh. I'm kind of gross. Hi everyone, it is Kelsey. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be doing another swimwear review. Of course, what is new, you guys? It is June, okay? I need to be giving you guys really good options for summer, okay? So let's start off this video. If you guys can't already tell by the title, I am going to be reviewing a new swimmer brand, and that brand is TU. TU is a company based out of Canada, I believe. Actually, all their suits are made in Canada, which is pretty awesome. I think that the fabric is imported from somewhere else, but Canadian-based, we love. So any people from Canada watching, you don't have to worry about like your duties or fees from coming outside of the country, which is really awesome. We love that for you. How I found out about TU was because I was on Pinterest and I saw a swimsuit and I was like, Ugh. I have to have this in my life. First, like I had to insta stock to like find where the suit was from, right? I finally found it and it was sold out and I was so mad because it actually took a really long time for me to get this suit. I had to wait for them to put it back on the website in my size. It's been a hot minute since I not only looked into buying this suit, actually you guys I bought this in January I was supposed to review it like a really long time ago edit upload obviously and I just I didn't do it so I'm sorry but we're here now I wanted to show you guys so the suit is the Olympico suit I'll try to put the picture that I found on Pinterest but I don't know I was just like so like <gasps> wow she's beautiful okay so I believe it's called the Olympico please I'm stupid though, so don't judge me. <laughs> All right, so, but this is it. A cute, nice little like sports bra or what I like to call a surfer gal type of top with no padding. And then these are the bottoms. How adorable. Let's talk about the fabric. So clearly the, both fabrics are gonna be the same. So the top and the bottoms are made out of 80% polyamide and 20% spandex. The hand feel of them is really soft but also like stretchy and I feel kind of sporty. They're really good quality of suits. Got a nice stretch to them. I don't know, I really like the hand feel. It's not like as soft as some of my other suits but it has more of like a sportier presence. I don't think that made sense. So they claim to have UV ray protection. They're breathable and quick drying. And it says that these need to be hand washed with cold water, not exceeding 30 degrees. Do not bleach, do not tumble dry, do not iron, drip dry. Just so you guys know how to handle and care for your TU second hand skin, second skin Swimwear? Oh my gosh, that was like really tongue tied for me. <laughs> I picked this one up in a size large. And so this is what she looks like. I know that the colors, they seem a bit patriotic. Um, I just, I really like the colors together. I think that they look nice because they're not like a, your typical like cobalt blue and like really rich cool tone red. It's kind of got like a cool tone but like orange almost type of vibe in my opinion. I really think that they're a cute color combo. I don't know if I said this already. I got this in a size large. I do wish that their size range was a little bit more in my opinion but I mean the suit's still pretty cute so I'll like kind I'm not gonna say that I'll accept it but I'll let it slide this time. Honestly I was a little bit nervous when I first got this in the mail because I was like oh shoot like I, my boob is not gonna fit from like here to here you know like only this blue portion because uh, I have like bigger boobs people if that hasn't been a theme that we've talked about like I don't know where you been. I do have like a bigger chest size and so I when I tried it on, I don't think that it worked the best. Like, it was okay putting myself, that sounds so funny, but into this, like, blue section. I think that the best option is to literally have, you know, everything filling up this entire from red to blue because you have a lot more space. We have this strap. I'm really hoping that, like, you guys can see this. Let me see. So you have this strap, right? It's going all the way down, and it actually goes into a loop on the suit so you guys can see like that thing on the bottom 
this loop right here it goes through and then they tie together which I think that's actually really innovative and cool um, I like that about it I guess like I have a couple of not necessarily complaints but a couple of like if I were to switch this to make this like my perfect suit what I would wish for is that the straps had been just a bit thicker I know that a lot of people don't love tan lines but for someone who does have a bigger for someone who does have bigger girlfriends over here it's a lot more supportive when you have a thicker strap especially on a sports bra surfer gal type of top in my opinion I like that you're able to tie the strings together I think that's really cool not only that you're able to kind of give yourself like if you really wanted you could cross these um, you could make this into a halter top it, you have options with it right even though like it's not meant to go that way, you still have options. I think the only other thing that I wish this swimsuit had would be um, the band on the back. I wish that that was adjustable because since the straps are a bit thinner, um, I wish that the band was adjustable so I could tie it tighter over here. I know that I don't really like to show off a lot of cleavage when it comes to wearing a swimsuit, so I don't necessarily want the whole tightness to be showing off my cleavage I just want it there so that there's support so that I'm not hanging down to my kneecaps okay because that ain't cute but other than that I think it's a really cute top I feel like if you are like if you have really big boobs like really massive boobs I'm not gonna lie I don't think this will fit you like unless you like things kind of hanging out and stuff if you like that then try it out but if you have like really big boobs I don't know if that's like the greatest top for you honestly but I still really like it and I think that it's cute the top is going to retail for 94 Canadian dollars which is going to be around 70 and change US dollars and then the next piece that I have obviously is the bottoms to match okay so I was really nervous about these bottoms I'm not gonna lie I was like how is this gonna work you know like there's this huge gap like in between like the front piece and the back piece I was like ah. I wonder how that's gonna look and I was a bit nervous I don't know why too like I was a bit nervous for like this huge like band going around I thought that was gonna be very unflattering and I am like I was dead wrong people these bottoms I when I'm telling you like the top is a good top but these bottoms are amazing and I'm telling you to like buy these like right now stop this video and buy them right now because they are amazing I love them so much so one thing that I'm always complaining about a lot to everybody is that there's never enough coverage for me. I like having the high leg cut so that my legs are accentuated and so that you can see my tattoo. I don't like the fact that there's never enough coverage on my butt. I know that I wear it sometimes, the ones that kind of are very, 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 very cheeky, but that's just like not me, so to speak. I think that these bottoms provide the like best amount of coverage ever because they're Obviously, um, they're cheeky, but they're not like a thong. They give you like cute, like a cute little peachy booty. Really like these bottoms so much. And another thing that's really great about them too, as you guys can see, is that they're high-waisted. So the reason why I like high-waisted swimsuits is because I do have a bit of like a little bit of a tummy. So it does. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. To me, when you have something that's going a little bit above like that whole line that you got going on it just it flatters you you look a lot better in my personal opinion I think that it's super cute I don't know I'm just like obsessed with these bottoms honestly got these in a size large and they fit me amazingly so like even if you don't like this colorway definitely get them I believe they have these bottoms in black they have a bunch of different colors in this style bottom and I 100% swear by it like it's so cute like, another thing too is that they have a seam and I'm not always like a crazy fan of seams now I feel like a lot of companies go seamless but I really don't mind the seam on this at all it's like really really cute comfortable I don't know these are my favorite bottoms if you could only get one or the other definitely get the bottoms and get the bottoms in a color that you're gonna wear like all the time because the litter I 
I want to buy another pair of bottoms in the black because they're so amazing. And I just hope that like in the try on you guys can see like it's it's so cute. Oh my gosh. The bottoms are going to retail for, I believe they are 88 Canadian dollars, which is around 66 US dollars. So 66 and change around. So overall, like price point wise, you're talking about a moderate, like obviously I know spending 60, $70 on a top or a bottom is very expensive. And to some of you, it might be a little bit ridiculous. I justify it because like I'm always in a swimsuit and I think that like just the good quality ones, there's so much like there's just something so satisfying about having a good quality swimsuit instead of getting something from like a Forever 21. And I definitely would recommend them. So as far as packaging goes, um, everything, I bought this in January. So why I still have this packaging, I have no clue. But it's a good thing, right? So they just came in this box. Yep, this is a box. No, it ain't stupid. So it came in that bag. Um, and then everything also came in a little TU baggy. So I think that this is like cute, you know, it's extra packaging details and stuff, but I don't think it's necessary. I have like 5 million swimwear bags. And then everything also too came in like another, all the, the top and the bottom both came in like a little plastic baggie. So they don't claim to be like a sustainable company. So I'm not going to like dock points off for having like a lot of plastic, but that's like something that I tried to lean away towards but other than that i think that this is honestly like such a good company to look out for honestly you guys super amazing quality stuff tiffany she's always coming out with new stuff so you can follow like their tu swimwear account on instagram but you can also follow like tiffany's instagram because she's always like posting on her stories like little snippets of like new styles that are going to come out and it's it's really cool to kind of see the behind the scenes process and stuff. I didn't pay for shipping for my swimsuits because I got a um they were having like a promotion or a discount code for free shipping, so I hopped on that bandwagon. Let's see how much Let's see how much shipping it's going to cost. It'll give you guys an estimate. It gave me an estimate of around $11.52 Canadian so let's see how much that is I'm just gonna estimate it at 12 so it's around like nine dollars to ship it to me and I'm from New Jersey so it's like not obviously it's nothing like a triangle and Myra swim I want to say costs around 10 bucks to ship um, but that's Express International so I feel like that's really not like a horrible price range but just keep that in mind um, they do have a lot of promotions a lot of the time I'm gonna center myself back um, but they do have a lot of promotions so if you check out their Instagram or if you're subscribed to their email listing you can definitely make sure that you can like at some point buy the suits on promotion for either a discounted price or just for free shipping that's it for this video guys um i hope that you guys enjoyed it and i really hope that some of you are motivated to pick up these amazing bottoms because they're adorable i just wanted to say you guys thank you so much for watching and i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and i will see you next time bye